Around 2005, the Queen and her personal protection officer, Dick Griffin, were walking alone one afternoon in the hills near the Scottish royal castle, Balmoral. Two tourists approached them and engaged in conversation. So Griffin recalls the story. Two hikers approached us, and the Queen would always stop and say hello. They were two Americans on a walking holiday. It was clear from the moment we stopped that they hadn't recognized the Queen, which was fine. The American gentleman told the Queen where they came from, where they were going next, and where they'd been in in Britain. I could see it coming, and sure enough, he said to Her Majesty, And where do you live? She replied, Well, I live in London, but I've got a holiday home just the other side of the hills. He said, How long have you been coming up here? She replied, I've been coming up here ever since I was a little girl, so over 80 years. You could see the cogs whirring, so the tourist asked the Queen, Well, if you've been coming up here for over 80 years, you must have met the Queen. Griffin continues, Quick as a flash, Her Majesty said, I haven't, but Dick here meets her regularly. The hiker then asked Griffin, what the monarch was like in person, because he was with her a long time and he knew he could pull her leg. So Dick said, oh, she can be very cantankerous at times, but she's got a lovely sense of humor. The next thing Dick knew, this guy came round, put his arm around his shoulder, and before Dick could see what was happening, he got his camera, gives it to the queen, and said, can you take a picture of the two of us? So the queen took a photo, Griffin continues. Then they swapped places and took a picture of them with the queen, and they thanked us and went away, and we waved goodbye. Afterwards, her majesty he told me, I'd love to be a fly on the wall when he shows those photographs to his friends in America, and hopefully someone tells him who I am. Rest in peace, your majesty.